about what this film is about from your perspectives. Sounds like many people are wearing different hats, and I like that. Many people wore many different hats. Um, I, uh, the film is about a, uh, a, a down and out soldier who can't feed his family, and uh, he takes this low rent mercenary job guarding a prisoner in a hotel. Everything goes disastrously wrong, and um, they end up having to run for their lives. Uh, 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 Mia, who, who plays uh, uh, the June's wife, the, 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 the main character's wife, uh, uh, gets involved, and they all end up kind of having to uh, somehow survive with the help of their survivalist aunt and uncle in the deep, deep desert. Yeah, it's like a desert kidnapping thriller that's quirky and has a twist. Let's talk about your character. Sure. I play Mia, so I'm the wife to June. Uh, they're going through a real rough patch in their marriage. They have a child, and um, she's basically been holding down the fort like a single mom. Even though he's there, he's not really there. And they get some financial trouble. Uh, the movie really puts us in extreme circumstances, and it's how do relationships survive after that. Um, you have to watch it for yourself. Do we stay together? Do we not? And from the director's point of view, what was most interesting? What did you want to portray to the audience for this? Um, this, when I, when I work, my, my, my best stuff is not from my head. My best stuff I is really inspired by something I really love. Um, this was inspired by a, both a friend of mine who's in the military, uh, who, when he joined, he's a combat controller in the Air Force, which is like, one of the, there's only 500 in the world, they're like the best of the best. And he, he said, um, he wanted to put his body between those he loves and harms away. I don't remember if he said those exact words, but that was the feeling he had when he joined. And that generosity part really moved me. And I've had a lot of people who come back kind of very embittered. And I wondered what it would be like for him to survive that, to come back and to be able to be resurrected. I have been working in here for a long time, and this film was written for my friends. That's the thing that, that really kind of gets me going as an artist. I have friends with these incredible capacities, this amazing mix of abilities. Franz, uh, our, our, our fellow producer, who's both an MIT guy and an actor. Liz, who I first uh, found when we were doing 12th Night. Yeah, he cast me in my first uh, first production out, out of school. It yeah. was an honor. Yeah. yeah. And so she's playing Violet, one of the hardest roles, because you have to find someone that everyone in the audience is going to fall in love with, believe that everyone falls in love with, and at the same time has some of the most beautiful poetry in Shakespeare. And, and she can pull that off. I, like we, we, we literally were looking and looking, and, and she had that. And I feel like all these people were being overlooked by Hollywood because you know they didn't have the right mix of stereotypical elements that they could use. But I was like, you know what? They're stupid. I'm going to use this to my advantage. I'm going to use these, these people with these amazing skills, and, and we're going to create something that no one's ever seen before. Talk about having it the closing night. How, how fun is that for you? Oh, sorry, we're not, we're not closing. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Uh, we are, uh, but they, we do have the honor of having two, two showings here, and they've put a lot of faith into us. Um, and uh, we're so honored to be here. I mean, for us, this is our home festival. We grew up watching yeah. the films here, and like I was telling someone else, it's like watching the Lakers and then someday being a Laker yourself. It, it, to, to have the future here, it's, it's a big honor. Okay, last question, your social media contacts, please. All right, well, you can find me at The Liz Ho Show on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat. Uh, Ryan Yu, R Y U N Y U, I know, unusual. And, and it's uh, um, at, I'm uh, at Real Ryan Yu uh, on Twitter and uh, just Ryan Yu on Facebook. And we have a Facebook page, The Last Tour. <laughs> Say that one more time. <laughs> we have a Facebook page, The Last Tour. Go follow us.